Wow, wow, wow. Supreme Court in cahoots with Trump. <laughs> New York, I'm Chris Hayes. Today, the right-wing dominated Supreme Court gave Donald Trump a gift. The, the biggest possible gift anyone could give him. The biggest possible gift they have given him yet. Remember, Donald Trump, of course, participated in a violent co coup to overthrow democracy. The first president to set himself squarely against the constitutional order in history. He rallied his supporters to storm the Capitol and steal an election he lost. And he was indicted by our Justice Department, representative of us, the people, on four federal felony counts by a grand jury for his role in that insurrection. Well, today, in a single-page order released at 5 o'clock, the court agreed to consider Trump's manifestly weak claim that he is immune from prosecution for the January 6th insurrection because he was acting in some senses of his, in his official capacity as president. But the order itself is not the story here. It's the timing. It all comes back to the timing. Let's remember, the court case, the trial of Donald Trump over his effort to subvert the Constitutional Republic was originally set to begin days from now in March. All that is on hold because the Supreme Court wants to hear oral arguments for Trump's immunity claims, ready for this? Seven weeks from now, April 22nd, 2024, making it a real possibility, a likelihood in fact, that Donald Trump will not face a trial for the crime of attempting to overthrow the American Republic, will not face a jury of his peers until after the next election in which he is the likely Republican candidate. Hey, hello friends, we come to the end of the day. Have you subscribed yet? Yes, press the subscribe button and the like button and also the share button. Thank you and have a nice day.